Hi everybody, this is Sarah here. Just stopping by to invite you to my paparazzi jewelry show tonight at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time over on my paparazzi Facebook group page. If you're not a member, join and I'll accept you into the group. Um, if you don't know about paparazzi jewelry, Everything's five dollars except for the kids, and it's a dollar on the jewelry. Um, I ship it. Um, I can only ship in the United States. That's what paparazzi will let only let me do. We can't ship outside of the United States. Hi, everybody. Um. So that's why I'm just popping on. And let you know about the party. It's always Friday nights at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And down on the main description default box, I put the link to the Facebook group page to my paparazzi thing. And so you can find me. That's where I post the lives at. And the other link is for if you can't make it to the party, but you want to order or you want to look at paparazzi jewelry. Um... My, there is my paparazzi website that's open 24-7, and you can shop or look, whatever you want to do. <clears throat> oh, thanks, Matthew. That's so sweet of you. <clears throat> it's a busy, busy day. I'm going to be taping a new um, intro to the channel trailer. Because we have the old one up. And it's time for a new one. We're going to be taping a new video today. Um, and then I got to get ready for the jewelry party tonight. And so there's busy, busy, busy day. Usually Fridays and Saturdays are busy. Well, Sundays, Sundays too are busy for me. Um, also, we're going to have an, a Tupperware party tomorrow at um, <clears throat> 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and uh, but I will post a separate invite for it with all the links to it tomorrow, sometime. I thought I'd just pop on and do the invite and also answer a few questions. I'm not going to stay as long as I have the last two at live invites. Eastern Standard Time. <clears throat> I don't know. The initials for it is EST and it says Eastern Standard Time. I am making a cookbook. I am in the process of that. It's a long haul process, but we're, we're starting on it and hopefully we'll have it done. It's going to take a few months probably because there's so many steps to it. Because we have to go through and after we've topped them all up and we put them in the system and make pages. And then we have to go with a fine tooth comb. Make sure there's everything's like the descriptions okay of reading the recipe. There ain't no uh, misspelling or we've missed anything. All the measurements are right and stuff like that. It's a lot of work. We've got... I think four or five, maybe six of us girls working on the cookbook. Oh, yes, yes. I That is so nice, Emmy. Yeah, if y'all didn't know, I, I told about in the last uh, video, but I finally got a P.O. box, and it's in our default system in the description. So anytime you want to send me a goodie, a card, um, um, Christmas card, whatever it is, or fan mail, there it is for you. <clears throat> no, I haven't tried that, Jack. Um, I have pinned a couple um, recipes that I found on Pinterest. Pinterest for it, but I haven't I haven't made any of that Because I have a few friends that are vegetarian um, 
And they eat it a lot. I think it's called Satan. I think that's how we say, they say it. It's on the list. The cream pie's on the list. Where do you have that written down? Uh, Brittany, you just read my mind. I put them down on the list this morning to make, um, now you talking about the mozzarella sticks that are like rolled in breadcrumbs and you dip it in marinara sauce, or are you talking about the cheesy mozzarella bread sticks or the pull apart? Like you get it like a pizza place. Um, I think it, I think I already have some, them up on my channel if that you're talking about that but if you're talking about the other ones I've got to do them <clears throat> um I live in West Virginia the ad address is already up in the default section down in the description part under the video, it's on every, it's going to be now, for, um, like the last video that we put up, Lawrence Fiesta Potato Soup, it's in that description, so it's automatically go on, it's going to go under every video or anything I put up. Oh, I can't wait to get that, Faye. Believe it or not, I had deep fry, fried Oreos a couple summers ago at a little festival, and I didn't care for them. I just, I would rather just have a regular Oreo. Maybe because it, it was so greasy. It, it was really, maybe their oil wasn't heated up enough, um, and it soaked up all the oil. I don't know, but it was so greasy. <clears throat> but I'll put that down on the list. To do for you. I just won't be any, eating any of them. I'll make them when I know my uh, niece and nephew are coming up. So that they can have some treats. You mean hamburgers like... Patty it out with seasoning and all that stuff. Is that what you're talking about? Or are you talking about grinding meat up to make hamburgers? Um, I have a few hamburger uh, for the grill. I think I have one or two up from last summer. But if you're talking about grinding, I haven't done that yet. But for Christmas, Jamie got me the grinder attachment to my KitchenAid stand mixer. So, I'm really wanting to... You know, do some fresh ground meat. For I won't be eating it because you know, if you've watched my last live, I barely eat uh, beef meat. I just don't care for it. But once in a great while, I'll treat during the summer, at least um, twice during the summer, to a hamburger. Um, so I might have one, two bites of it, but I probably won't have no more. But I like chicken and shrimp. I eat a lot of veggies as my meat, especially a lot of mushroom as a protein instead of meat on the plate. I was just always been that way ever since I was little. <coughs> yes, I've got the cream pie down. I've never heard that kind of sandwich, um, but I'll write that down so I can look at what look what it is. Uh, yes, I love Indian food, and I need to do a little bit more of that. <clears throat> I want to learn how to do paneer, make my own paneer, because I cannot get it around to any of my groceries around here unless I drive two hours away you know, to bigger grocery stores but uh, that would carry that stuff. But I plan on doing a lot, some more Indian cooking. No, 
No, not yet, but um, I have an ice cream machine, and when we moved, you know the little paddle that goes in it to churn the ice cream? It got lost somewhere. We have now found it. And I'm going to see if I can find a replacement for the brand I have. If not, I'm going to have to buy a whole new machine or um, something. But I've been wanting to do that. <clears throat> no, I don't have a good egg crusted yet. Beans in a movie theater. <laughs> no. I don't even eat the popcorn either because I can't have it. So I usually take, um, stick a bag of mini pretzels, the little snack bags in my purse, and that's what I eat. Now, Jamie eats the popcorn, but I can't. <clears throat> uh, the Flaming Hot Cheetos, I can't have them, but I'm, I'm going to have to get get a snack bag and see if Jamie can handle them because he can't handle real spicy stuff hi Faith um I Remember if I have the white queso up yet. It's on my to-do list, but I don't know if I've got around to it yet. Um, I like pasta, and especially a lot of veggies, especially when it's grill season. I love to grill lots of veggies on the grill. <clears throat> no, I've never cooked with jackfruit. We can't get it around here. I would have to order it off online or off Amazon if they had it, in, you know, the, in a can or like in a package and get it shipped to me. But um, they say it's good. And I know they use it, uh, vegetarians use it for a meat substitute. Um, my favorite dish to eat during the summer to be so refreshing, watermelon. Ice cold watermelon. And I sprinkle a little bit of salt on it. And sometimes um, Jamie likes to have um, fresh mint chopped up finely and put over his watermelon. <clears throat> and then sometimes he likes the dried edible lavender flower buds. And he sprinkles a few of them. But it's usually just salt, a little bit of salt in my watermelon. I can make a meal off of a little quarter piece of watermelon. Okay, I'll put that down on the list, Faye. I was just at Walmart. I had to run to the grocery store. I should have went down that aisle. If not, I'll look online at Walmart.com. <clears throat> First, I want to see if my the part to my other ice cream machine would be cheaper. And if that is, because I have the whole thing to sit for that little paddle thing. Now, I've never made any Dutch food. I love me some ratatouille. I don't think I've done it for the channel yet. Do, do you have a link where we can buy stuff for you off of you Daisy that's already that um 
jackfruits in a can. <clears throat> um, or do you get the jackfruit and can it? <clears throat> I've been cooking since I was a little, little girl. Yes, I do remember Chi Chi's. Yes. I have never heard of grilling watermelon. No, but I do have a recipe pin from Pinterest about that cauliflower um, fake potato salad. I can't eat popcorn because of diverticulitis issues. I have to watch the nuts and seeds. I can't have any of them no more. We don't have a Trader Joe's around here. I think the one that's closest to us is like six hours away. Both. I like cats and dogs. Okay, okay, Daisy. I'll I'll check out that link. Um, you're. Oh. Okay, I'll, I'll email you. I'm copying your email right now. No, it's because of diverticulitis issues. Where you get infection. My necklace that I'm wearing is paparazzi, and I will have two of these tonight on my show. So if you watch my show, you can you can get one. But I only have two left. Um, it varies, Jack. Sometimes it's just me and Jamie, and sometimes there's four to six. Pasta and veggies is my favorite food. Um, <clears throat> give me shampoo for your hair. Um, it's called um, uh, oh Lord, it just my mind went blank. It's tea tree oil shampoo. Um, it's not Avalon. What is it called? I'll have to sit here and think of it. It has just lost my mind what brand it is. I don't have Mr. Tipsy no more. I do have a cat, and it's a boy, and his name is Mr. Winter. Because he was born in the wintertime. Yes, I'm always the designated cook. If have you sent a friend request, Cheryl, to my um, Facebook paparazzi group page? That's where my lives are. If you sent one, I've accepted it. But if you haven't sent one, um. You need to send one so I accept it. So you can, um, watch the shows. I keep touching my hair because, well, I just got back from town, um, to Walmart, and there was a bee flew by my head. It was, 
I'm filling to make sure it was, when I come inside it wasn't in here. I'm just getting back into makeup. Um, you can tell I'm not wearing it now. I, I have a hard time wearing it during the summer. I feel like it just runs off. Um, but there is, I have got a foundation from e.l.f. That I, that I started using. And then my other one is Olive. I tried to say that. Olive. Um, but my, usually my eyeshadows I wear is from Amazon, um, not Amazon, Amazon. I got Amazon on the brain today. Uh, Avon. And so is my mascara and, um, but for my, uh, face wash, uh, I use just a, um, um, like a Cetaphil. Uh, face wash, or I will use the, um, there's a makeup remover that I just got at Rite Aid, and it's from Burt's Bees, and it's the mineral, uh, I forget what the real, uh, the name of it is, I know it's by Burt's Bees, but you put it on your little rounds and wipe your makeup off. And it cleans down deep into your pores. Um, I have tried sushi. I don't like the raw, but I like the ones with veggies. And there is one that has like, I think, is it crab meat? I like it. Yes, I do have a few on my uh, channel pink. I cook with uh, olive oil or avocado or oil or coconut oil, but if I'm going to deep fry, um, usually what goes in the deep fryer is vegetable. And like you know, like when you have oil, you're making cake or any kind of recipes that calls for oil, then usually that's what I use in them. I used to have one up on my old channel, the pot pie recipe. I don't know if it's on the new, you know, this one. But I'll put that, put that down on the list. I've never got any of your tweets, Tyler. Yeah, we're working on cookbook. Um, yeah, I do like living out in the country. I have lived in the city, yes. <clears throat> Comments are scrolling so fast, I'm trying to catch some of them. I'm going to have to make them go back down a little bit. It's actually a dress that I have on. Um, dessert. Christmas time. Any kind of, like, Christmassy cookies. Thanks, Gloomy. Yeah. 
Yes, I do have, um, 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 polycystic ovary syndrome and injury endometriosis. I see you, the president. Um, there's so many shifts. Yes, I like to cook Asian dishes. <clears throat> I don't know if I'd ever do a meet and greet. Yes, I do watch the Food Network. Yeah, I used to watch Paula Deen. Oh, yeah, that sounds like a cute summer treat for lollipops. No, I've never seen Master Chef. Um, we have a produce stand. Um, and I yes, I do go to it during the seasons when it's open. <clears throat> um, it depends, uh, Craig. Sometimes I buy it already made, and sometimes I make it my own, make my own and get a whole chicken and just make it. Because I'm going to be using the chicken anyway to do chicken salad, or I can get, you know, two or three meals off the chicken, or making chicken noodle soup, or paw paw. There's so many ways to use a chicken. I do have a watermelon drink recipe. I think I'm going to be up. These are brown, brown beets. And this is a brown, I mean, I mean, blue wooden. They're all wooden. And then these are wooden discs with little small wooden beads intertwined in the brown rope. Nope, I have just ordered uh, a, a little ice pop kit. So as soon as I get it, I'm going to make some. Yes, I'm loaded down with gooseberry patch cookbooks. I'm a cookbook quarter and I'm in it. I have never had stuffed pretzels. I love pretzels. I've never done tiramisu. I have done a creme brulee, but it was on my old channel. I need to put a new one up. No, um... Right, I have made my own jewelry, but I hate making it right now. The stuff that I usually wear, and you see me in the videos, is paparazzi. And um, that's what I sell. But I have, I'm starting to work on um, 
Etsy page. I haven't got it up yet, but I'm starting to make little kids' hair bows. <clears throat> and then I'm hopefully when we do some um, handmade paintings up on it, you never know what you're going to see up on it. I don't have a Costco around me. I think, let's see, I think it's like three and a half hours away. The only um, stores I have around me is a Walmart, um, a Food City, if you've ever heard of that. And of course, um, then for like Family Dollar, a Dollar General. I have to go to the next town over to do that. And that's where the Walmart stuff is. The little town I live in, we don't have any stores except for um, a couple gas stations and a police department and stuff like that. And a post office. You mean the paparazzi jewelry, Ann, Anna? Um, my link is in the default. If you're interested in selling under me, you just click the link and click join, join my team, and you go from there. And you get your starter kit. There's different starter kits. I went for the smallest starter kit and started from there. Okay, I will look for the stuffed pretzels at Dollar General store. Um, um, we our Dollar store, Dollar General store ain't open right now. They tore the old one down, and they're in the process of building a new huge one. So the only one we have right now is seven dollar. But they said that the new Dollar General store will be should be done by the end of summer or the first part of fall. No, I never use somebody else's recipes from their um their sites. I have I've um I'll explain it a little bit different. I have like used like two or three of their ingredients, but not the full list of ingredients and then I then um I will take totally deconstruct their recipe and use two or three of their ingredients. And their measurements, and then add my own veggies and stuff to it, and seasonings, and make it my way. I have some smoothies up on my show. Tonight is the joy party at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. No, I don't. I can do the chain of crochet, but I don't know how to go on with the next row. Did you see me trying to? Um, it just, just depends on your corn and how done you like it. Either way, Craig. Yeah, I need to put a new meatloaf up. Hey, I don't, I'm probably going to butcher this name. Happy birthday. In... See ya. I'm probably butchering it. 
Happy birthday, E, whoever you are. I'll just call you E. Yeah, I used to work at Food City. This is way, 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 way before when me and Jamie, before we got, we started dating and during we were dating. You mean my paparazzi Facebook page? It's in the default. You can just go click the link and go right over it, but it's called Sarah's Dazzling Doodads. I'm, ha I'm having company today, so I'm going to make, they requested, hot ham and cheese and fries. And then I'm going to be taping a dessert after I get done talking to you for tonight. That they requested, and it's going to be dirt pudding. Um, um, it has vanilla pudding and crushed up Oreos and stuff in it. No, I've never done gumbo. Um. Yes, I did work in the deli and bakery department. Also was a cashier at front. Sometimes. You would have to, um, Jack, um, when you make your videos, monetize them. But starting a YouTube channel is a lot of work. And also, how can I say this nicely? There is going to be trolls and haters out there. So make sure that you have thick skin. If you click voice, voice check in the default button up above this video. Or down below it. I think it's down below it. Is the default. And I have the link to the Facebook paparazzi page. Just click it and it will take you on over. Yeah, just experiment, Craig. On the grill. <laughs> Miguel, I think that's how you say your name. Hi, Randy's, Randy's mom. Yeah, so it'll be a live video on my Paparazzi Jewelry Facebook page. I 
I love me some cheese and veggie quesadillas. No, I've never never been to Disney. Okay, I'll put that down on the list, Bailey. Um, I don't have a corn chowder up. You just got to go to my Facebook, not Facebook, my paparazzi uh, 24-7 website, and if you want to join my team, you click it, and then you have the choice to what kit, kit you want to start out with, and you go from there, and I went with the smallest and started from there. No, I don't have no spicy Cajun chicken pasta. I don't know what would be the one thing that I could use in the kitchen. What's one thing you could use in the kitchen, sir? <sighs> counter space. I wish I had more counter space. Um, I actually get the season that's already made for steaks or a hamburger in the grinder things at Walmart. Sometimes I've made my own. I've looked up ideas on Pinterest and kind of concocted something. We are doing another clap video coming up. Um, we have a Father's Day one coming up and a Fourth of July one coming up. Pasta. And there ain't enough cupboards, cupboards for stuff to go into. That's one thing, too, that drives me insane. Oh, I'm sorry that you're in South Africa and you can't get it. No, I've never been to the Cheesecake Factory. Yes, I do barbecue sometimes. No, I've never made a cornmeal pie. Alright, I'm going to spend one more minute on here with you guys and then I've got to pop off because I've got to get some stuff done. Are you talking about the little, um, I call them like little cookies that are little balls and they've got the pecans in them and they're rolled in powder sugar like cookies? Um, yeah, I plan on doing them for this, um, holiday season. Um... 12 years we've been married. We dated for two to three years before we got engaged. And then we were engaged for almost three years before we got married. So we've been together for a long time. Um... Not really. He stands in the kitchen and watches me and talks to me and stuff when I make dinner. 
Um, but like he'll hand me stuff out of the fridge a lot if I need it or um, get something out of the pantry for me. Yes, I grew up. If you're talking about, uh, we called it potato candy um, in our household. Um, I haven't made it for a long time. But usually we used to make it around the holidays. My aunt still make it and all stuff. I would have to dig somewhere in the closet for our big album of our wedding stuff. Yeah, he's my camera guy and my editing guy. Well, I'm going to pop off here because now I've got somebody coming up to the door. I hope to see you tonight. Pop on over to my uh, live paparazzi um, party tonight at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Bye, everybody.